we're quite a small department here at the Wallace Collection. We, everything we do takes place on site and we treat, uh, we treat our wooden objects, our furniture collection and uh, metals, things like our arms and armour in-house. I guess we concentrate on a range of different treatments, so there's very remedial stuff that might be more of an emergency treatment. And if something's uh, decaying and, or has, a, has been an incident in the galleries and then there's more longer term projects that we uh, discuss and decide with the curatorial team that we need to work on and then we'll look to do maybe a bit more of a bigger treatment of an object to ensure it's restored to uh, some of its former appearance. I come from quite a traditional sort of woodworking craft background. I uh, trained as a, as a carpenter and joiner and I spent quite a few years working in joinery workshops and doing freelance kind of work before I sort of fell into working in uh, art galleries or museum conservation workshops and it was through, uh, through working in conservation workshops that I kind of picked up a taste for conservation and a little bit of understanding about what it was and how it, how it worked as a, as a practice. Mostly here at the Wallace Collection I work with um, the gilded wood um, so lots of carved surfaces, lots of uh, actual finish, surface finishing with gilding. So usually with, with the frames it's a case of uh, doing a bit of surface cleaning and then repairing uh, any t actual losses to the surface, so infilling them with gesso and then uh, repairing and preparing that surface for gilding. The next stage is to add a coloured clay which further smooths the surface, prepares it for, for gilding, adds a tonality to the final layer. And then finally it's a gilded and distressed to try and integrate it with the uh, existing surface. Another project that we're working on at the moment is to uh, try and restore a, a gilt wood chair. So part of what we're, we're talking about this appeal to raise funds for that project is uh, with a view to restoring it back to a condition um, how it would have looked like when it first came into the collection. In, in museum conservation, we, we do things a little bit more minimally than restorers would do them in, in the trade. We, we're not necessarily always trying to return something to its original appearance to make it look brand new. We're, we consider all of the uh, previous alterations and the history of the object to be quite valuable. And at the Wallace Collection, we have the value of the, the, ca the family context of the collection as well. And that's, uh, that takes into account how the object appeared when it was actually came into the collection, it, came, it was acquired by the founders of the collection, mostly in the 19th century, so we often try to restore things back to an appearance from sort of around 1890 when the uh, collection was actually bequeathed to the nation.